Yes, sir, more people wear Timex than any other watch in the world. And more people have seen Jimmy Durante entertain in nightclubs than any other entertainer in the world. And no show with Durante would be complete without a couple of courses of Bill Bailey. What it's bring him back? What'd he say? Jimmy! I want to walk with dignity. Jimmy. Jimmy Durante, ladies and gentlemen, is appearing in a nightclub in Philadelphia. And he flew here this morning. The plane was three hours late. And everybody thought, what a terrible thing to make this beloved man go through all of this trouble. But you see, I had to have him here tonight. He doesn't know what's transpiring this moment. But I must tell him what is in my heart to represent all of show business. The Hollywood Press Club honored you, Jimmy, on the occasion of your 50th anniversary in show business. But that wasn't enough for me. There were only 500 people there. I want 50 million people to know that we adore this man and we wish him Godspeed in many, many years. Happy 50th anniversary, Jimmy Durante. for the anniversary of Mr. Shrine. Oh, 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 God. I, 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 I thought it was Mr. Shrine. Danny, I don't know what to say. You don't have to say anything. How about a couple of courses of Bill Bailey? That'll be better than talking. Pull the cake away. Come on, Jimmy, go. You ready, boys? Get it. Go, baby. Won't you come on up with the baby? Come on. Stop the music. Stop the music. Jimmy Boy. What's this Jimmy Boy business? Jimmy Boy. Jimmy Boy. What are you, a cheerleader or something? <laughs> if you want to root, go out and sit in the audience. And I know that you, that you always have, have Eddie Jackson do the number with him. He's in Philadelphia, and I just thought I'd fill in, make you feel like Oh, that. you want to take Eddie Jackson's place? That's right. Fine. <laughs> You'll start again. Hit it. I think I had enough of you. <laughs> Get the nose on this guy. <laughs> if the both of us ever sneezed together, we'd have Hurricane Hannock. <laughs> okay, you're finished. I only hope you have some other source of income. <laughs> hey, Fisher, come in. Would you like to do uh, Eddie Jackson? No. Huh? <laughs> We'll start again. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Hold it, hold it, hold it. <laughs> what, is that the way to do the strut? I didn't come here to do the strut. I came here to do the swim. Oh, you came here to swim. <laughs> I'd like to have, I'd like to have just what the barber cuts off. <laughs> it came me to swim. Yeah. Well, there's a beach, uh, there's a beach about eight miles down the road, and there'll be a bus coming along any minute. Be honest. <laughs> be honest. Oh, Smiley, come in. <laughs> Oh, 
Let's see what you can do with it. You know, this is your big chance. Thanks, Jim. We'll start again. Won't you come home, Bill Bailey? Won't you come home? She moans the whole night long. You were the best of the three. <laughs> I'll do the cooking, hunt. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Stop the music. Don't press your luck. <laughs> you know something? I got a, I got a great idea. I really got a great idea. Maybe the three of you guys together could make one of these Jackson. Come here, fellas. Come here. Hey, we'll start again. In our audience here at the Grove and all over America, it's been a very exciting night for me. I hope you've enjoyed it. On behalf of Frank Duvall and his orchestra, thank you. I'd like to say thank you to Freddie Martin, wonderful band leader, for the use of his bandstand, and to the Coconut Grove for the use of the hall, and special thanks to Jimmy Durante. Why don't you pick one up and smoke it sometime? And Timex, world's largest manufacturer of watches. More people buy Timex than any other watch in the world. in color in association with the NBC television network.